What's going on guys? Nice to see you again. I hope the holidays are working out good for you. And just to let you know, Christmas is going to be this Friday, which I'm actually very excited about, by the way. But before I get into this product review, I just want to let you know that I have recently reached um, 200 subscribers. So I wanted to just give a quick shout out to all the people who have supported me. And I wanted to say thank you so much for your support and for you watching. I really do hope that my reviews of products and whatnot have um, helped you make the right decision in choosing the products for you. So thank you very much for your support and I greatly appreciate it. Appreciate it. Couldn't have made it this far without you. But I'm going to be reviewing another Shea Moisture product. This right here is the Superfruit Complex Body Lotion. It is from the Superfruit Complex Co um, line from Shea Moisture here. You can find this at Target, Ulta Beauty, and Sally's Beauty Supply. The price would have to be somewhere around $8.99 8 to $9.99. Now it might be significantly less if you have either one or both things here. The first one is if you have an Ulta Rewards card and you have some points on it that you can use to decrease the price. The second one is the Sally's Beauty card. If you have that, then the price will be somewhat lowered. I don't know exactly how lowered. Well, actually, I don't remember how lowered it would be. And if I do, I'll see if I can put it in the description below. But this is pretty much what the bottle looks like. I picked this up from Target a while ago simply because I ran out of lotion and because I wanted to try out this lotion for the first time since I've read different reviews about it and people said it was really good. So I picked it up and I've been using it for a while now. Yeah, sorry, there was something in my eye. But I've been using this product here for a while now. The only reason reason it looks funny is because I've been squeezing it but I'll get to the packaging in a moment so I'm pretty much down to somewhere along this line maybe like a third of it left I'm not entirely sure but the main ingredients in this are um, mango butter the green coffee bean extract and it also has something called the superfruit complex which is evident in the entire super complex complex line superfruit complex line it is a blend of goji berry acai guava and raspberry and raspberry it's like a little berry complex a little fruit complex that helps with um anti-aging so if you don't know about the superfruit complex it mostly deals with anti-aging but that's not particularly why i chose this so anyway I got this, I've been using it for a while now, and I have to say, it is a really, really good lotion. Um, I guess I could start on the scent. I can't say much about the scent. I mean, if I smell this straight from the bottle, I can smell the little hints of fruitiness in it, but then when I take it out of the bottle, when I squirt it out of the bottle, um, I can't describe the smell when it comes out of the bottle because... I still smell the fruitiness, but it's not as evidence, evident as it once was if you just smell it straight from the bottle. And the reason I keep holding this bottle upside down is because now, concerning the fact that Shea Moisture makes their lotions really, really thick, with the exception of the Argan Oil and Raw Shea Butter Lotion, which by the way, they changed one ingredient in that lotion. It no longer has Shea Oil in it, it has Shea Butter. But. Because Shea Moisture has a tendency to make their lotions thick, I usually store their bottles upside down, which is what I did for this one, which is why I keep holding it upside down in the video, in this video here. But I've used this lotion mostly after I'm done showering and bathing, and it does pretty well. It does keep me moisturized. It's really thick, and it's pretty creamy too. Let me show you a bit of the consistency here. Well, not really a good consistency but you get the idea it's really thick it's really creamy it's almost like frosting cake frosting that's how I would say the consistency would be it moisturizes very well it keeps my skin very supple supple and it keeps it moisturized for a couple of hours before I have to reapply again well before tomorrow after I'm done showering and whatnot sorry about that but um it does, it's good on the moisture factor and it's very easy to apply. I recommend applying this after you're done bathing or showering. That would be the best time for you to apply, apply this stuff here. Sorry. But um, 
Okay, on to the negatives about this product. You already know that I'm going to talk about the packaging. Okay, there's a reason why I keep storing this stuff upside down. Like I've mentioned before, Shea Moisture has a tendency to make their lotions pretty thick. Um, wonderful, wonderful lotions, but it's just super thick, which was the problem that I had with this. Now, out of the lotions that I've tried from Shea Moisture, this would be the second easiest to get out of the bottle aside from the Argan Oil and Raw Shea Lotion back before they didn't change the ingredient. But this is relatively easy to get out of the bottle somewhat, somewhat at first, but because I'm getting down to nearly scraping the bottle now, I have to store it upside down and I have to squeeze it really, really hard in order to get something out of it. So as a result, I've been storing it upside down and I really, really, really wish the Shea Moisture would change the packaging. Packaging. I just really wish that they would change the packaging because while I love this lotion, I still think that this is the kind of lotion that at least needs to be in a jar or in a squeeze tube, tube here. That would be, that's pretty much my only complaint about this. I do not like the packaging. Love the lotion. Love the lotion. I don't like the packaging. Now, on the terms of it being an anti-aging product because it claims to contour, firm, and smooth your skin. Sorry, piece of hair in the way. Because it claims to contour, firm, and smooth your skin, I can't really speak on those issues alone about this stuff doing that because I'm, I'm 23. I'm still young. My skin is still very supple and I was only concerned with my skin being moisturized since I have dry body skin. So in terms of it being anti-aging and what it does, I can't really speak for that. But for other people that I've read reviews on, people said that it has smoothed any bumps that they have on their skin and has made it very smooth to the touch. I can't really say for certain that I've experienced that because I don't really um, focus on that because, well, it's, it's, I'm still young. So I would say if you're an older person and you want to focus and you want to um, use this product for anti-aging, then this would be a good product for you if you're an older person and you have mature skin. Otherwise, this is pretty much all I have to say about this lotion. It also says you can use this as a massage cream if you want. But that's pretty much all I have to say about this stuff. I might try it again, but I want to try other Shea Moisture lotions. I think the next one I want to try is the... The African Black Soap Body Lotion. Unfortunately, the only place where I can find that stuff is at Sally's Beauty Supplies since over at Target they've replaced it with the eczema and psoriasis body lotion of sorts. So the only place where I can find the African Black Soap Body Lotion is at Sally's Beauty Supply. But I really want to try that stuff out, out and I will be doing a review on that soon once I get the chance. But that's pretty much all I have to say about this product. Like I said, you can find it at Target, Ulta Beauty, and Sally's Beauty Supply. The price would be around $8.99 to $9.99. The price will be significantly lower if you have a Sally's Beauty card or an Ulta Rewards card with points on it. Excuse me. If you've tried this product before, especially if you're an older person and you've tried this product before, let me know how it worked for you in the comments below. I'd love to read how it worked for you. If you have any specific questions about this product, let me know in the comments below and I will try to answer them to the best of my ability. As of now, I am just gearing up to um, um, prepare for the Christmas, Christmas season on Friday because you know Christmas is my favorite holiday. So what I plan on doing is cooking a huge dinner. So I've been planning for that for a while and of course I'm gonna go see my old folks. Pay some respect to them. But um, I do hope the Christmas season has been going very well for you. I have more reviews and I will be getting them out soon. And like I said before at the beginning of the video, thank you so much for your support for, for um, getting me to 200 subscribers. I couldn't have done it without you guys. And I thank you so much for um, being patient with me, for your support, and for watching my videos and even sharing them if you wish. Okay. And if you like this review, a thumbs up is always appreciated and feel free to share it if you wish. Okay. So I will see you in the next video and in the next review, okay? Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and I will see you then. Bye-bye, everybody.